Hey guys, it's your coach Scotty Hobbs. It is Tuesday morning. As you can tell, I'm over my sickness. I feel awesome this morning. Today was bulk uh, or build chest and tries with Body Beast. I'm just getting ready to enter my third month, so I'm extremely pumped out about that. Feeling good about my results. Feeling good about life. I uh, just wanted you guys to know I finished a couple books. I finished Overcoming Rejection Will Make You Rich. If you want to know what that book is about, it's about, I, I was skeptical about reading it. I've had it on my shelf for a long time because I don't like that term rich too much, but it, it ends up being about being rich in relationships, being rich in life, being rich in, you know, in, in your thoughts, everything uh, applying to that. Absolutely amazing book for anybody that is in sales or multi-level marketing or a leadership position in a company. Uh, sales uh, mainly because uh, basically it's teaching you that you've got to go through the no's to get to the yeses. Um, also reading a book, I uh, can't remember what it's called, but I'll post it up on my Instagram today because I got about uh, 10 more minutes of reading left on that. It's a Brian Tracy book about sales and also about time management. So I'll make sure to post that book up by Brian Tracy. And I also started reading finally, Go For No which is a super easy read. I'm sure I'll have it done tomorrow. I started this morning, it's super thin. But it's an easy, easy read. So if you don't like reading, this is a good one to start on. Um, but there's something I wanted to talk today um, and, and make sure that you guys all understand. And, and I, I do my best to teach my, my team this. You guys will hear me say all the time that success is not your rank or your income, your position in a company or whatever. Success is your ability to, to know 100% your purpose and the vision for your life and have 100% belief in yourself and then to do the daily actions with that purpose in mind. And if you do those daily actions with consistency, with discipline, not worrying about the no's or the rejection and the objections that will come into your life, if you do that, that list of your priorities every single day with that full belief in your purpose, you are successful that day. And I, I teach my team that. And in what I want to lead you guys into that with is that so many times we look at our life and we think we're right here, over here we have arrows to success, over here we have arrows to failure. But that's completely opposite and wrong. I want you guys to understand it's like this. You're right here, this is you. Yes, you, I'm talking to you right here. This is you. Next in line is failure. Next in line is success. It's not like this, you, success on this side, failure on this side, it's you. Next failure, next success. When you can grasp that to become successful, you have to fail every single day, then you're going to embrace the fact that you need to fail every single day. When you can embrace the fact that you need to fail every day, you're going to have success. So if you fail a little, you're gonna have a little success. If you fail somewhat often, you're gonna have success somewhat often. If you fail every single day massively, you are gonna have massive success if you keep your mind and your intentions and your vision clear every single day of where you want to go. If you do that, massive failure equals massive success. And what I want you guys to know about that, for those of you that are in multi-level marketing like I am with Team Beachbody, yes, Team Beachbody is multi-level marketing. If you want to grow a huge organization, so we have 15,000 coaches on our team with Team Beachbody in three and a half years. And the way that is possible is because we are teaching and embracing failure. So you have to do the math, simple as this. If you massively fail every single day, you're gonna have massive success. If you enlist, enroll other people to understand and embrace failure, you have a lot of people if you, let's just do the math again. If you have a lot of people failing just a little bit, you're going to have a lot of people with a little success. If you have a lot of people that you are enlisting a lot of people to embrace failure and they're failing massively and they do it consistently with discipline, 100% mind focus on their vision and their purpose and failing massively, you are going to have, that is right, massive success 